Hey folks, good morning. This is Imran back again with another video. Uh, hope you guys are doing well. And uh, make sure that you watch this video till the end. So I'm gonna teach you one more word today. So, yes. Uh, today the video is regarding uh, uh, the uh, a sweet uh, named Ferny. Okay, it's called this Ferny. So it's it's quite interesting and it's an amazing uh, sweet I would say and it's super duper easy to go ahead and prepare uh, this particular sweet. And before uh, going into the video, make sure that you like, subscribe, uh, share the video, and uh, you know make sure you click on the bell icon so that any any videos that I post in the future. You get the notifications of that and you can uh, watch uh, those videos so let's go ahead and quickly run uh, inside the video all right so let's go ahead and talk about the ingredients that you need uh, to make this ferny okay so the first ingredient that you need is some semolina make sure that you get a full cream milk to make the sweet and we have a special ingredient here I think you guys can see that it's the food color I would say that's very important for a dish and this is ghee this is cashews and pavams we already have a few chopped Bathams and cashews here, so and few raisins as well. So these are the uh, vital ingredients you need to make ferny. Alrighty. Right. Step number one: you have to turn on the gas or stop, whatever it is. Step number two: you have to. Pour the milk in a vessel and it has to boil for like you know till it boils <laughs> all right righty the milk is almost uh, is coming up coming up coming up all right this Sweet is actually prepared by my spouse. All the curds goes to her. She's actually stirring it pretty well. And she also mentioned that we have to boil the milk properly. Uh, all right, step number two. She's gonna Put some semolin inside of the milk. Alright, you have to stir that very well. You would have to keep stirring continuously. Alright, here comes the step number three. You would have to add some foot color wow all right oh wow what a magic what a magic look at the color that's awesome all right the white color of milk has completely changed into orange red and uh, the brand that we actually use for this is it says Anuja Super Orange Red okay. you have to keep stirring it pretty well so that you know uh, you get a nice color okay so next step I forgot the step I mean it's like four or five 
not sure about it but the next step is like adding sugar to the milk all right all right that's pretty nice okay again after um, putting the sugar in the milk okay can you see the semolin uh slightly heavy beautiful beautiful but it looks great okay okay you have to keep stirring it's it's with the sugar so you have to keep stirring a lot of hand work to do here in this wonderful this is actually done now so we have to keep this item aside we have kept it here separately now we have taken a small bowl you guys should be wondering what's actually happening now right we are going to take a spoon and some amount of key oh my goodness look at that i think people who have cholesterol probably they should be uh, irate on me but i'm sorry no other go uh, we have to put some key here in order to make this sweet little tasty okay righty you need to keep a spoon inside i think i'm not sure about it yeah okay the next step would be oh my goodness i love cashews here comes badams make sure that you don't put a dry uh dry fruit inside the sweet that that will not the, um, doing the us. Yep, we need to fry the nuts. Increase the stuff for fire. And make sure that you fry the nuts. Raisins. It's, it's become a little fluffy there. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Try that little more. Uh, when the nuts are pretty big, you can, if you like, you know, you can chop uh, the nuts a little bit smaller. Uh, this, and then you can go ahead and use that in the sweet. Okay. Okay, here comes the main part. Okay, okay. Oh my goodness. Lovely. Lovely, 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 lovely. Mmm, yeah, I think you have to keep the back on the stuff and start. guys the sweet is ready we are done with ferny i don't know uh there is another name for ferny let me check with my spouse and uh, tell you that she's telling me it's mudanji i don't know if you know we're not sure about it but yeah the other name for ferny is mujandir Mutandir, Mutandir, it seems okay. Okay, she is pretty hesitant to talk over the video, so yeah, maybe I'll ask her to speak in the next video. All right, so today's lunch would be Ferny. Look at this chicken biryani. Wow, that's so nice. It looks yummy. All right, guys. So I'm back to my seat now, and uh, I just wanted to um, quote you a single word today. Uh, the word is actually uh, called as petrified. 
petrified that spelled as p e t r i f i e t all right that's spelled p e t r i f i e d that's petrified the meaning of this word is actually scared or you know terrified or getting frightened all right so you can uh, use that in sentences like i was actually petrified when uh, the police officer started questioning me my friend got petrified when he met with an accident my friend got petrified when his father came to know uh, that he smokes every day so you can use this word in day-to-day -day life and uh, this would actually help you so all about the word today i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure that you like subscribe uh, my channel and uh, kindly click on the bell icon because if i uh, post another video uh, maybe you guys would get a notification and you can enjoy watching uh, the video i hope you like the sweet as well and uh, thank you so much and you guys have a wonderful day bye bye